Welcome to the Israel Ride instructional video series. We hope these videos will help you learn how to best prepare for the Israel Ride. This video will go over how to best train for the Israel Ride. First and foremost, decide which group you are interested in joining. There is limited availability to switch groups during the ride, so we suggest training towards one group in particular. Set your training regimen. Set your goals. Decide how rigorous your training will be. Gear up and hit the road. We've noted a few key skills to develop to make your cycling safe and enjoyable. Learn how to use your gears to maximize output while minimizing input. Get a feel for your bike and how it handles going around obstacles like fallen branches, potholes, and rocks. Practice hard braking to develop muscle memory in case you need to brake suddenly. Remember to sit back in the seat when braking. Building your stamina is crucial to long distance cycling. Get on your bike often and a few days in a row. Increase your mileage with each ride. Remember to also exercise off your bike to maintain overall body fitness. On the Israel ride, you will quickly learn that the hills are your friend. Use the momentum of the descents to make your climbs easier. On sharp descents that have switchbacks or sharp turns, feather your brakes and sit back in the seat. And remember to brake early. We will mostly be riding in the desert, and temperatures can get into the 90s Fahrenheit or 40s Celsius during the day. Staying hydrated is extremely important. Listen to your body if you are not feeling well, and let our medics know immediately. There's shade and sunscreen available at rest stops along the way. There will be minimal urban cycling, but enough to be ready for. Practice cycling on your local streets at home to become familiar with biking near cars, noting traffic laws, and staying visible. We suggest tracking your training with a handy chart to see your improvement over time. This chart is available on our website for download. The Israel Ride is a group event, and it is important to learn how to ride with others. Always pass other riders on the left and call out to warn them. Use hand signals when you are slowing or stopping or when you see obstacles on the road. Look out for other riders in distress. Please do not draft behind another rider without their permission. Always ride single file on busy streets. On the Israel Ride, this might be an easy rule to forget as you fall into conversation with your fellow cyclists. However, this is an important habit to keep in mind, and our lead and sweep riders will be reminding everyone to ride safely throughout the week. Keep your body happy while cycling by eating right. Eat lots of complex carbs, proteins, and electrolytes, and keep the sugars to a minimum to make food easier to digest. And most importantly, don't forget to drink water. While riding, drink enough water to match the intensity of the exercise, the heat of the day, and your body's needs. The average recommendation is one 16-ounce bottle per hour in cool weather and up to as many as four bottles per hour in extremely hot weather. All riders must wear a helmet while riding. Each rider is given an Israel Ride jersey and water bottle. Other items are available for sale in Israel and we recommend bringing bike specific clothing to make your ride more comfortable. Please refer to the packing list in your handbook for more details. Don't hesitate to reach out if you have further questions. We look forward to riding with you on the Israel Ride and seeing you in Jerusalem.